How do we feel, babe? This is actually happening. Oh my god. Abby! <laughs> Can you believe this? I don't know how to explain it, but it feels like home. We've never seen it empty, you guys. How does it feel to be a homeowner? I'm like nervous. It's so echoey because it's empty. Echo! Echo! So much life is going to be lived in here. Like so many memories are being made in here. Yeah. This is just the first. I just got here and I don't ever want to leave. <laughs> I love it here. First time peeing in the toilet. <laughs> How you doing in there, honey? Are you recording me? I can see your head, but I can't see anything else. <laughs> oh, hello! Hello! Whose house is this? <laughs> our house! <laughs> That's now, crazy. this is our house right after buying it. You walk in and there's a beautiful open... You can see the top level. I don't know what that's called. <laughs> Just a very... Is it an open floor plan? Is that the name yeah, of what this is called? So okay. this is our half bathroom. Wow. Oh, just circle mirror. Wait, dude. I think that's a circle mirror from Ikea. Really? I love those. Yeah, I I'm pretty see. sure. It looks great. This is a guest bedroom. Nice. Where family will stay. Yes, we're so excited about that. Finally, we have space for family to come visit Thank us. You, and they're literally coming in tomorrow. You guys should stay tuned for those videos. There's so many crazy things. This is like the craziest week of our life. There's a closet. Okay. And then we've got ourselves another bathroom. Nice. Dude, this is actually a really nice bathroom. I've never taken a minute to enjoy how beautiful this is. Yeah. The nice. ceilings are so tall, it's all white. Yeah. I love the pattern on the back of that shower area. Yeah. Oh, I like this mirror and those lights. The Whoa, yeah, that's really cool. This room we're like gonna have to try to figure out what we're gonna do with. Yeah. But it's like a little sitting room that has an outdoor door that's Point. attached just to the guest bedroom. Maybe we could do meditation in here or something. <laughs> I think we might use it as like a little sitting room, like office space. Yeah. With like a pull out couch if we have more guests. Whoa. Dining room. Nice. Hey, they left the shelves for us. That's really cool. Yeah. This is the living room. Dude, I'm so excited for our couch to come in tomorrow. It's going to be perfect to fill this space. And then this is the kitchen. Nice. Oh, it has a filter. Yeah. So we don't need to get a filtration system here? I guess not. I'm loving the kitchen. I think one of my favorite parts about this kitchen from the minute I saw it was this massive island. Yes. Look how big it is. Abby's like freaking 10 feet. No, more than 10 feet away it's from me. Your the light fixtures are cool too. I like the Edison bulbs. I think it'd be so sick if we did like a backsplash along the back of the kitchen to just kind of give it more of a homey feel maybe. We have a lot of changes we're probably going to make. Yeah. But time. Yeah. Paint the walls and things like that. Got ourselves a dishwasher. What? We have a dishwasher? Full size too. Guys, I don't think, have we ever had a full size dishwasher? Did we have yeah, a full size dishwasher in our first apartment we did? I'm really excited. I was Yay. Gas we got a microwave, fridge, freezer, everything. Wait, I just realized what? we have never owned a pantry. No, so this is really exciting. Back yes. here we have a big old pantry. Yay! Oh, and a Swiffer. I didn't know that came with the house. <laughs> I guess it does. That's amazing. It's really big. This is huge, dude. I think there there might be paint down there too if we need to repaint certain rooms yeah. and stuff. That's There's awesome. Like garage and stuff. What's in this room? This is like a coat closet. Oh, nice. Because most of the time we'll be coming in from right there. This yep. I've already decided is going to be like my coffee station. Dude, good idea. What's, so we're going to have an espresso maker, a coffee maker, what else? Yeah. Are we going to have like syrups lined up? Yeah, we're going to have the whole setup. Oh, first I'm having a garage too. What the heck? We have all that space to put our car? Yeah, and there's like a little store. Wait, how do we turn on the light in here? What if we got locked out of our house? Wait, we should make sure that we're not getting locked out. Hey, it works. Very happy about this. Another little garage over there. But it's not connected to the house. Your belly looks really cute, honey. Oh my gosh, it's really popping. Oh so, my gosh. Yeah, it's a really actually decent sized patio. This is a very nice patio. You're Ooh, so right. It's chilly out here. Yeah, it's kind of cold today. There is the pool. Ooh, yeah. Got I'm pumped for that. <laughs> and then there's just like a little patch of turf out here. So yeah, you're so right. Do some fun stuff with that. Put some plants over there. Maybe we could put like an orange tree or a cactus or a palm tree back here. A big idea I do have for the backyard is, is that a scorpion? 
Is that a spider? What is that? It's a spider. Oh my gosh, dude, that thing's freaking like a really huge. Creepy spider. Holy crap, I didn't know they had those in Arizona. Get out of here. Abby, do not get that close to it. <laughs> is it alive? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. That's terrifying. It might be poisonous. Holy crap, how are you not afraid right now? You're I so like calm. Bugs. You're so calm, dude. Abby, stop. Abby, stop. <laughs> Dude. Hopefully one day we'll put a half pipe in the back so I can skateboard and teach our sons and daughters how to skateboard. You said sons first. Does that mean it's a boy? Uh, babe, oh, we can't tell. We can't tell them the gender until the gender reveal party. Oh. What? Hey, that's kind of nice. These what is it? These... What? what is that? that is so sick. That's cool. That is very cool. Let's go check out the upstairs. Mm. Yay. Mm. All right, come on up, muchacho. Upstairs. Yay. And this is the loft space, which Yay. we also are still trying to figure out what to do with, but yeah. might make it like an office with loft living space. We loved how some homes we saw when we were looking at homes had beams on the ceiling. So maybe if we did some beams like up there, it would just add a lot of dimension and make the upstairs look really dope. Yes. Yes. Then we've got a closet. Okay. And we got the laundry. Nice. Laundry room. Wait, they have their washer and dryer indoors here in Arizona? Is that how they do it? It's wild. That's crazy. The way you're walking is <laughs> I'm trying to follow. I'm just like following Abby like this. Do we record slow. you and you take the tour? Uh, yeah, I can do the tour. Um, like, like we were talking about earlier, we're thinking about doing hardwood upstairs. We're going back and forth. Apparently. I looked it up, I did a Google search. If you replace your carpet with hardwood, you get like 70 to 80% of your value back in the home when you do that renovation, so it might be worth it. This is gonna be the nursery. We think it's perfect for our little baby's room. I actually really like that light. Should we keep the light in there? We're stuck right now between doing a space theme or doing a Toy Story theme. So comment down below which one you think we should do. Oh wow, there's lots of closet space in here. The people- Yeah, they before, left some kid stuff in here. They had here. a little girl room. Oh, that's so cute. They got, got a little pink little bin. That's really cute. <laughs> that's adorable. Yes, bathroom. Does our house have four bathrooms? Three and a half, yeah. Three and a half, so three full, and then one is just like a toilet. Yeah. There's no shower. Ooh, we got that nice design here in the uh, shower area, mm -hmm. a big, nice, full mirror. This is cool, so like if we have guests over, someone can do their makeup here and someone can like brush their teeth at the same time. Amazing. Love this. It's funny because we haven't been in the house that much, so like some of the stuff I'm literally discovering right now, it feels really weird. We've also never seen it empty. Here's another guest bedroom. We're thinking that we could probably put a desk right here because there's a beautiful view out of the window. Maybe this could be your office, Abby, or mine, either way. And it could be like an office slash guest bedroom. I love white. I love that all the walls are white. I feel like it really makes this space feel big and bright and happy. But it would be sick if we had one room that has black walls. Yeah. What do we think about that? Let's do it. Got nice closet. size closet. Every single closet in this house is bigger than any closet we've ever had. I know, it's pretty wild. This is crazy. The master bedroom. Let's go. So over here, ooh, they already have the green wall for us. Yeah. We love green. We're thinking that we want to have like green on our bed, green throw pillows, bring that color into the room. Maybe they do some shiplaps. We can always change the color of green right here, but we have a lot of good ideas for our bedroom. I even did a mood board to try to, you know, <laughs> Think about some cool, fun interior Matt's Mr. Interior ideas. Decorator. We have a ton of work to do. We've got a beautiful big window here so we can see outside. The pool is right down there. Guys, we have a king bed coming in tomorrow. <coughs> We've never owned a king bed. I think right now we're sleeping in a full. Is our bed right now full? Or is it I can't tell, honestly. It's somewhere between a full and the queen, but this is gonna be the first king we've ever owned. This is so sick. I think I almost wanna get one of those round mirrors from Ikea right here. Yeah. It'd be really pretty in our room, don't you think? Over here, oh my gosh. This closet is so big. Dude, this closet could freaking be a bedroom. This closet is very large. Is I don't, very we don't have large. this much clothes. I think we could fit every single belonging we have in this closet. This bathroom's sick, dude. It is. It looks great. We have a tub for Abby. I know Abby is so so, so pumped to have a tub. Yeah, so here, let me. You got to be on camera. Tell me about how excited you are for this I tub. I am so excited to have a tub. This is so fun. It's a perfect size. You haven't been able to take a bath in actually months now because we've been living in a place with just a shower. I know. I miss baths a lot. The shower here. Ooh. Dude, this Crazy. is a cool looking shower. Crazy. Glass doors and everything. Yeah. Got, Got big ears. Dude, we both get our own sink. I, I think just. This is gonna be your room. Yeah. Like, I'm 
yours. Why did I just now realize that we both get our own sink? Like not you even- just now realize that? Yeah, I never even thought about that. Like not that we have like a sink on like the same sink area, like two of them, we both get one. I realize that we're gonna have to get each our own toothpaste now and our own toothbrush. Oh my gosh, I guess crazy. we could just walk over to your side. We could, we could. We don't share actual tops of the toothbrushes, we just share the same base. We yeah. have our own toothbrush top. Yeah. But sometimes I use that. Yeah. And the toilet. Ah. Oh. Got all toilet. We have a whole entire room just for the toilet. Wow. Should we see if we like the scent that they left? I feel like I'm acting weird because I just don't know how to process Dude, it. Dude, same. This is kind of, this is really weird. I'm just so pumped that we have space now for family to come and friends. I'm like freaked out a little bit because it's like when you've lived in such a tiny, kind of tiny quarters yeah. for so long, it's kind of like, mm -hmm. It's like, does it, does it feel like too big or too? It, just, it feels so foreign. I think this is coming at the perfect time though because we have kind of been arguing a lot the past few days. <laughs> we're, because we're in each other's space all the time. Like we are always, because we're in a 400 square foot studio right now. So we always are on each other's butts. Spread out. That'll breathe, be good. Especially, especially since we work from home. Abby's giving me a chokehold right now no, because I set, up, I set up our Wi-Fi in 30 minutes and she spent three hours doing it and got nowhere. I have frustration. Let's unload this car. I like these lamps you picked out, man. Dude. Those look nice. We decided on those together. They look really, really nice. 30 bucks from Target. Oh. What? There's something on it. Oh, let's just face that towards the, like, the walls. So people don't see it. I'm just so happy, you guys. I don't know. It's so exciting to save up for something for so many years. We saved up for a house for four years, by the way. And to finally make this happen right before we have our baby is but just like, so most exciting. Importantly, too, is that like we get to share this house with like, like our family's really coming, some family's coming tomorrow. On Saturday, we have someone coming over to set up a charcuterie board. And we're yes. having our whole family here. I can't wait to watch this video <laughs> back someday and be like, this was our first day in our Oh house. my gosh. It's like, it's, our, it's a core memory. You should grab core, my butt. I did grab your butt. But this is a core memory we just watched Inside Out. Ah. Uh. And we're not even spending the night. <laughs> <laughs>